Golan Shemdov here with the Delphi Light team. In this video, we'll see how we do GMX monitoring for a server running on Docker. In this case, we'll use Apache Tomcat as an example, but in general, it should work for other application servers in a similar way. This is our build directory. I decided to make things a little bit more fun here. We have the Catalina.sh with the JMX flags that we will use to replace the default Catalina.sh. We have the Docker file for the build, and I created a Docker Compose file that will be used to launch four Tomcat instances. This is my Catalina.sh. The flags here are a little bit different. I'm passing a server host name. And I'm also passing two JMX port flags, pretty much passing the JMX port as an environment variable. Then we have the Docker file. Very simple, pretty much we start with a Tomcat image, replace the Catalina.sh with our own Catalina.sh, and chmode it. Last but not least, we have our Docker Compose file, giving the container a name, exposing ports, and passing the environment variable for JMX port. This way, every container that starts gets the JM export as the environment variable and listens on that JM export. We build the Tomcat JMX image, run the docker compose up command, and now we can switch to our Docker tools and see the containers running. We now move to Foglight to the application server's administration dashboard and set up the agents. Choose monitoring location or monitoring agent manager and click on the connection assistant. Select the connection type, in this case it's Tomcat, so it's JMX RMI, and give the host and the port. We will repeat this four times with different settings. We're going to use the Tomcat model that we have and just use the default MBIN server group. This is the connection information for Tomcat 6. This is the connection information for Tomcat 8. And this is the connection information for Tomcat 9. We now have four agents that were successfully created and are collecting data. All that's left for us to do is go to the application server monitor and look at that data. In the application server monitor dashboard, we can see for Tomcat server, and we can drill down and see additional information for them. I hope you find this video useful. Thank you very much for your time.